Hi everyone, welcome back to Total Coins. So on this video, we're going to be carrying on with our 50p coin hunt. We've got our 250 pound bag of 50p's here. And just like the other videos that we've done recently, uh, obviously to help build the channel, I want to try and set a goal for likes on the video. So if I can try and get 30 likes on this video. So if you do like the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, obviously, if you subscribe as well, don't forget to ring the bell icon to be kept up to date when I upload new videos. Uh, it really helps me sort of build the channel with all the likes that I get. Obviously, YouTube will then help me sort of promote the channel. Um, and it just helps us sort of build the channel and allows me to sort of do more and more sort of interesting videos for everyone. So, with that said, let's have a look what we're looking for in our 50p album. So, we're still looking for the Kew Gardens. Obviously now only got one on this page to do, which is boxing, as we got fencing in the last video, which was great. We're still looking for go ball, gymnastics, judo, pentathlon, shooting, and tennis, weightlifting, and wheelchair rugby. But other than that, we have everything all the way up to the 2019 Sherlock. So we've had some great runs recently. And with that said, let's crack on with a hunt and we'll see what we can find. So we'll do the first, we'd normally do the first bag in real time, but we've got quite a few sort of loose ones in this bag. So let's gather them all up. That's the bag that's opened. Oh, we've been having this a lot recently where the bags are sort of coming open sort of before we get to them. I think that's all the loose ones. So I'll put them off to the side and what we'll do is we'll do these ones and then we'll speed up after that. So first one we've got there is shield. So with the shields, we're looking for the years 2009, 10, 11, 16, and 18, as they are NIFC years. Obviously we haven't had 18 confirmed yet, but it's expected. So we'll put them off to the side and we'll look at them after the hunt. And then we've got Britannia. With Britannia, we are looking for the year 2008, as that is a low mintage. Oh, and I almost forgot. With the shield, we're also looking for 2017, as that's a low mintage year as well. So, 2017 shield, 2008 Britannia. And there we go, so there's our first commemorative. So it's 2017's Tom Kitten. Obviously the 2017 Beatrix Potters are all quite highly minted. But nice find to sort of start us off. So what we'll do now is, is we'll speed up and as soon as we come across anything interesting, we will stop the video. And there we go, we've got our next one, which is 2018's Representation of the People Act. So, uh, we still, at the time of recording, we still don't have the mintage figures for 2018. But hopefully they will be coming soon. Obviously, if they have come out uh, since recording this video, I will update the annotations in the top corner here. And you'll be able to see what the mintage figures are.
And there you go, and there's our next one. So that is Christopher Ironside. So a nice coin. Obviously this had the potential to be the, this was actually in competition with the Britannia, uh, to actually be sort of the general coin. I can't actually remember off the top of my head what this coin is. No, can't remember. <laughs> but yeah, nice design, nice find. Obviously we don't find a lot of them, or haven't been finding a lot of them at the moment, so that's good. And there we go, there's our next one. So it's 2017's Benjamin Bunny. So the most common 50p in, uh, the most common commemorative 50p in circulation with a mintage of 25 million. Not great, because obviously we find quite a few of them on all the hunts. Obviously, the day of recording as well, um, it has been confirmed that the new Brexit 50p will be going into circulation as well. And there we go, we've got another Benjamin Bunny. And there we go, there's our next one. So that is the Battle of Hastings. So the Battle of Hastings have actually, uh, has actually gone above face value now as well. So if you do come across them, make sure you're keeping hold of them. And there we go, there's our next one. So that is the Commonwealth Games. So, nice one to find. We don't haven't been seeing that one too often. Well, not recently anyway. So yeah, yeah. nice finds. And straight on to the next one. Victoria Cross, Heroic Axe. So another one that was featured in the 50 Years of 50p set. So really nice, another common one though. And there's our next one. So we've got Dictionary. 
So we've been finding quite a lot of this one recently. It went, we went for a spell where we weren't finding hardly any. Um, but it seems to have uh, surfaced quite a lot recently. So it is a very common one, but nice find nonetheless. And there we go, we've got another People's Act. And there we go, there's our next one. So that is 2016's Mr. Tiddlywinkle. And we have another dictionary. And yet another dictionary. And another Christopher Ironside. And there we go, we have another Mrs. Tillywinkle. And there we go, there's our first 2018 Beatrix Potter. So that is Taylor of Gloucester. So a lot of people, sort of, a lot of coin tubers are reckoning that this will be the more common one. Um, I know recently, sort of, I've seen a, a massive amount of Mrs. Tittl uh, Tittlemouse. Um, so yeah, eagerly waiting to sort of see what the mintage figures will be and which one of the 2018 Beatrix Potters will actually be the higher mintage. There you go, straight away we've got Victoria across the medals. So another one from the 50 years of 50p military set. There we go, there is our next one. So it's Benjamin Britten. So a lot of people don't like the design on this. Uh, I, I don't think it's too bad. Sort of, you normally get, normally you find them as well. They're normally in quite good condition as well. But this one's actually above face value now as well. So if you do come across these in your change, make sure you're keeping hold of them. And there we go, yet another dictionary.
and there we go there is an Olympic so it is Olympic canoeing so it's one we've seen quite a few times but nevertheless always never gonna say no to getting an Olympic absolutely brilliant And there we go, got another People's Act. And we have 2017's Peter Rabbit as well. So just one more to get, and then we've got the whole 2017 set. And there we go, we have a Paddington at the station. So I've actually recorded in this video, uh, just have had the email this afternoon saying that the new Paddington at the tower is being released tomorrow. So it gives you a bit of an idea when this video was filmed as well. Um, so yeah, 9am tomorrow, the new coins will be out and I will be on the website ordering. So I'm probably going to end up buying the uh, silver proof and the bunk pack but as soon as they arrive I will be doing a review uh, to be quite honest the reviews probably have been been and gone by the time you see this video but yeah really excited really looking forward to getting them tomorrow And there we go next one we've got is the battle of britain so with the battle of britain there are two mint marks on the obverse you've got jc which was the ones that were put into circulation and they had the fifth portrait of the queen sort of designed by jody clark and you've got uh, irb which is the fourth portrait of the queen and was designed by ian rank broadly so jc was intended for circulation and the irb was for the packs um, that were sold from the Royal Mint. So let's see what one we've got. It is a JC, so you'll see just at the bottom of the neck there. So, yeah, face value for that one. And there we go, we have a 2018 Flopsy Bunny. So not one that we've seen that often, so it's definitely going to be one of the rarer ones. Uh, I think that this will be the second rarest with the Peter Rabbit, 2018 Peter Rabbit being the rarest. Uh, I've definitely seen this one a lot more than the Peter Rabbit, so yeah, can't wait to, uh, to actually see what the mintage figures for these will be. And there we go, we've got another Battle of Hastings. So 
Uh, yeah, another one above face value. Yet another week where we have a 10p in with our 50ps. So, what have we been shortchanged? <laughs> We've got another Taylor of Gloucester. And a Girl Goeds. So another common one, but definitely a nice design. Straight away, we have a Tom Kitten. Right, so we are on to the last bag. So it's been a bit of a, a mixed hunt today. Sort of not a lot to sort of write home about. Definitely nothing new for the book. But in general, it has been a very interesting day for the 50p. So obviously, as I said sort of early on, the Paddington 50p is being released tomorrow. So very excited about that. Um, it's also been confirmed that the new Brexit 50p is going to be entering circulation. So I think the idea is is that it's going to be in circulation before Brexit actually takes effect in October. So hopefully over the next month we'll start seeing them in circulation. But that is it for the main hunt. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and have a look at the coins off to the side, sort of look for any, any key dates, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've gone through the coins off to the side and had a look, and I've been able to find one 2017 shield, and two 2008 Britannias. So yeah, that has been good. So, uh, what are we having as top pick today? I think it's going to have to be Flopsy Bunny, just purely because we haven't seen too many of her. So yeah, a nice find. Definitely sort of makes a change. So, with that said, that's going to be the end of today's hunt. 
sort of don't forget to sort of like the video sort of and subscribe to the channel and ring the bell icon to be kept up to date when I upload new videos. Obviously, all the likes that I can get sort of really help me sort of build the channel. So please sort of give me a like. Uh, you can also follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Links will be in the description below. Um, with that said, sort of thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing the next one. All right, bye.